guys, Danny AR10 here with my review of Shadow Complex for the Xbox 360. It's an Xbox Live Arcade title. It retails for 1200 Microsoft points, $15. And right now I can say guys, it's definitely worth the $15. And after a couple hours of playing with it, I can definitely say I'd pay re full retail price for this game. It is nothing like you've ever seen before. Uh, it is a 2D side scroller like the classic Metroid games but it takes place in a 3D environment that you can interact with 3D environments uh, he plays a character who basically starts off the game with his girlfriend out for a hike in the woods they uh, get abducted or she gets abducted by a group of uh, army soldiers who uh, work for an unknown at the moment uh, uh, army I guess an un unknown crew I guess right now they don't have a name yet and she gets abducted and it's being tortured to give up information because they think she's part of the NSA and he's out to rescue her and the game itself has amazing graphics amazing lighting and unlike any Xbox Live Arcade title you've ever seen before unlike any 360 game you've ever seen before it has a progression system that uses XP for experience points that lets you upgrade abilities that lets you uh, upgrade your weapons, it upgrades your ability to carry a certain amount of grenades, a bunch of hidden objects throughout the game. It's a search and find type game where you're kind of exploring the uh, levels as as you gain ability you're progressing back and forth to try to unlock uh, certain hi hiding spots. Only certain doors are accessible with certain power-ups like that door I just blew up it lights up green when you use your flashlight and shine it because that tells you what you need to open it. Uh, as you progress to the level, you can sneak around by crouching down. Uh, he does have a flashlight, which is very useful to light up areas where you can't see a single thing. And it unlocks or it tells you where secret hiding spots are by glowing a certain color. Uh, the game itself rewards uh, the amount of time you put into it you go back and forth throughout the level as you upgrade certain abilities and it gives you the ability to unlock passages which were not accessible before I just unlocked a new carbine which could be pretty cool uh, so it awards you being able to go back and progress to the game I just up level upgraded uh, and that's pretty cool because it forces you to go back throughout the levels and collect everything there's power-ups, health power-ups hidden areas where you need to unlock uh, See, that's green. I gotta blow it up. And as you guys can see, there's a lot of enemies you can fight. A lot of things to do in the game. A lot of action going down. Always something to do. Uh, always someone to fight. And it just looks amazing. It runs at smooth 60 frames per second. Uh, four difficulties range from easy, medium, hardcore, and insane. I start off on hardcore. You gain more XP the harder the level, the harder the difficulty you play. Uh, and just nothing but good things to say about this guy. This is unlike any game I've played in the last two or three years. It is just that good. I will pay full retail price for this game. Sorry about that, guys. Like I said, I'd pay full retail price for this game. And I advise you guys to go ahead and pick it up. I'm going to let you guys enjoy some more gameplay footage from this game. So you guys can kind of get make your own up, your mind up as to what you want to do but I say jump out and buy it guys it's definitely worth the price a lot of action going on you guys can see that everything's 3D interactive even though it's a 2D environment 2D game world everything's 3D interactive as far as the worlds flashlight you can turn on and off by holding pressing the LB button You guys can see, when you don't have the flashlight on, it's very dark. When you turn that flashlight on, it lights up a lot, guys. It's there for a reason. It's not just there for pretty. Flashlight helps. Sneaking around like this also helps you not become detected by enemies. Uh, also, there's melee moves. If you go up to an enemy and hit B, you can melee them. ton of achievements you can unlock, guys. I'm going to show you guys here. Quick melee. and it's dark it remains dark until you turn your light on which is cool about this level 
the game reminds me a lot graphically of Drake's Fortune, uh, Uncharted Drake's Fortune from uh, for the PS3. Uh, the character kind of moves around like he does, but it's just it's not like anything you guys have ever seen. You guys gotta, just gotta watch me play, and then go out and pick it up because there's nothing else to say. But just it's it's a great game, definitely worth the fifteen dollars or the 1200 Microsoft points, however you get, you want to look at it. Ton of enemies. You have unlimited ammo, uh, but your clips are limited. Uh, you, you can reload at any time. See here, I'm faced with a, a pretty tough little boss here. Now let me get my grenades in. I think the key to kill him is to drop that turret that on him, and that should work. There he goes. A lot of enemies, guys, all the time coming out. You can sprint with the X button as well, so you do have the ability to sprint. And pardon me guys, I'm not talking too much, I just want you guys to get a chance to see the game in action. The perspectives on the graphics uh, change, uh, the views, excuse me, the camera, as you progress through the game, uh, it changes according to uh, the level you're playing. I locked that passage up there, but I can't get to it right now. Gotta come back to that later. Right now, I have these two guys up there. You guys can see that I'm shooting enemies that are in the fo in the background. That's about it, guys. I just wanted to give you guys a quick little rundown of Shadow Complex for the Xbox 360, Xbox Live Arcade title. 1,200 Microsoft points. I'm going to give this game a 9.7, guys. This game is amazing. Run out and purchase it. Well, you don't even have to run out anywhere, guys. Just go online, download it. Definitely worth the price, guys. Danny AR10 here. Thanks again, guys, for all your support. Rate, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you guys soon.